Hi, this is Gen Paparisto, product engineering architect at Cadence, and today I'll demonstrate modeling and uh, uh, of the interconnects in VSS. In this demo, we will show you the new capabilities of modeling interconnects in VSS. So here we have a real simple RF link with uh, filters, amplifiers, and, uh, and a mixer in, in the middle, and we're me measuring things like g uh, cumulative gain and noise figure of the system. Uh, this is real simple, but you know that in, uh, when it comes to implementing it, you'll have um, layout strips between these components, and sometimes there can be uh, interaction between these strips, there can be signal degradation between them. So to model them, uh, in the past we've, we've created individual models for each of those strips, but now uh, what we've done in VSS, we've uh, come up with a new approach to, to doing all that. So. In this uh, window here, I'm showing you uh, a number of strips that are uh, modeled in a, in a layout. And these are the ones the, that connect uh, the components in the system diagram. To model this in VSS, we have a new uh, block called InterCon, which stands for interconnects. And what it does, it, it allows you to use, to refer to the same layout and you just define the input and output port for, for each uh, uh, portion of it. So each of these uh, strips, mi uh, micro strips that you, you model here, they would all point to the same uh, schematic, the same layout, but VSS uh, is, is capable of extracting the, the model for each of them individually and also uh, modeling the coupling between components. So when you run a simulation, you can see that now we in the x-axis, those strips are added uh, wherever uh, we place them in the system diagram, and then the results are uh, updated accordingly. And this allows you to quickly uh, evaluate the effects of the implementation of your or layout, and also uh, model any coupling between these, um, uh, these strips. Thanks for watching. For more information, please go to cadence.com.